to charge Duerson with felony child endangering. She made up her excuse, but uh, some things aren't very consistent, so we're not really buying her story. There is no, ex no excuse for a child to be left alone at any time. Ann Stevens with Montgomery County Job and Family Services says although families are feeling pressure during this recession, it's no excuse for mistreating a child. The bottom line is that you must provide for the well-being of your child at all times. Well, obviously this investigation is still ongoing and Stephen tells me that the boy will stay at the foster home until this is all sorted out. Reporting live in Dayton, I'm Holly Samuels, 2 News on your side. Okay, Holly, thank you. A motorcycle crash in West Virginia kills two people from Shelby County. 49-year-old Bruce Van Fossen and 48-year-old Barb Elliston died in that crash. It happened Sunday afternoon on Interstate 68 near Morgantown. Officers say an SUV made an illegal U-turn, cutting off the motorcycle. Van Fossen was a Sydney businessman, and Elliston, the public information officer for the Sydney, Ohio Department of Transportation. Peter Vauble of Botkins was following...